Okay, so this marks the first hey. video that we're going to do for our blog. Hey. We are at the last night of the Montrose Music Festival in Montrose, South Dakota. And we only have one baby with us right now. This is Nell. Buffy went home with Grandma and Grandpa. Grandma Mitch. And um, that is the number one key to success with uh, doing traveling and music and kids. Um, anyway, so yeah, uh, our tent was one of the first and is also one of the last. Um, we are shutting this thing down. Um, but yeah, this is the first of a few festivals we're going to go to, so it'll be fun to follow along. I can take your picture on. with all you. Hey, Dylan. Hey, Dad. Hey. How's it going? Pretty good. Cool. Yeah. Um, yeah, so last night at the festival. And how would you say it went this year? I would say it was uh, one of the most memorable weekends of the year. Yeah? It was, it was really great. Yeah, I got to see, got to hear so many amazing songs from so many people. It was such a great, uh, yes. great environment. Yeah, we got to just, uh, have a nice, Family time, so. Is that for mom? On the road again. On the road again. All right, hi. Welcome to the second installment of our little traveling family band situation. We are in the North Woods of Minnesota camping. Two days ago, we were at Folk Fest. And the weekend before that, we were at the Montrose Music Festival. And yeah, we're just camping with our two and a half year old and our five and a half month old. And, uh, we set up for the night. And I just want to share some things that I've learned about all of this stuff. And right now I'm going to focus on some camping things. So I'm going to take the camera and show you what I've got. Yeah. Well, oh, that's Guthrie. Hi. Can you say hi? Hi. Yeah. All right, so the first thing is this amazing tent. Um, this is like something I really recommend because, uh, you know, if you're camping a lot and you're going to festivals and stuff and you have a family, it's really nice to be comfortable. The setup this time was a little weird, so it's kind of funny looking. But, um, it's super duper nice. It's tall enough to stand in. And, um, it stays cool. And during the, uh, hot weather and warmer during cooler weather. And you don't wake up all wet and sticky like you do, um, in nylon tents. Um, also it's just really lovely inside, so... Now it's sleeping, so I'm just going to do a kind of top view here. And there's a sleeping baby. Um, and this takes me to another invaluable item for camping that I've found. And I'm going to see if I can show you around the other side. So... Here we go. All right, let's see if we can zoom in on it. Okay, that thing right there, that little white and aqua thing, is a portable noise machine. Um, it, you can set a timer for it, and it actually lasts a really long time on the battery. And we just turn that on um, to get her to sleep, and it's really super nice. Um. Okay, what else? Uh, so yeah, we traded our camper that was really expensive to run and just sort of difficult to maintain. And we just got a really good setup for camp stuff. So this is our camp stove. And it's like this Eureka brand and it just heats up really fast and it's really nice and efficient. Um, I'd like to get smaller camp chairs because we're working with these like kind of turns out pretty bulky ones right now and things fold. 
Okay, so um, another like totally invaluable thing that all festival parents know about, but in case you don't, it's the foldable wagon. This thing has saved our lives in every possible way. Um, it just, it zips and it folds really small. Um, and then it becomes, you know, a way of transporting kids, a way of transporting instruments or camping gear or anything. And, um, oh yeah, and even like having your kid nap in it sometimes. Guthrie took a nap in here the other day and it was really, really nice because he could just go around and do what he wanted while he slept. Um, this another thing, I'm still trying to decide how I decide, uh, feel about this um, self-inflating cooler. We really, like this is the car we're traveling in, so we need a lot of space. So we try to get a lot of space saving things. And this compacts down really nicely, but it doesn't have any sort of liner, so it just, the water comes out the bottom, so things, I don't know, it doesn't stay, ice doesn't stay in it really well. Um, so yeah, uh, jury's still out on this thing. Um, kid camping chair, really awesome. A tiny backpack with kids' toys. It's really nice to have. And, of course, the instruments. So, yeah, um, this will be probably the next little while while the baby sleeps so you can actually jam a little bit. Sing a song with me, Guthrie. to try a canoe trip um, with the family uh, once again in the spirit of bringing the kids along on our adventures um, so Nell's sleeping she has her life jacket on and she's in her oh she's not quite sleeping she's really not very happy <laughs> because she's very <laughs> tired and I the life jacket is not very comfortable um, but that's life sometimes. Um, yeah, they seem to be like pretty chill about uh, giving us this canoe with our five month old, so I assume it's not too dangerous. We decided to stay out of the big waters just to uh, be safe because it does start, the waves do start picking up a little bit um, when you get into the bigger waters. So, but this is really lovely as you can see. Um, and as far as like activities I recommend with a baby, I, I wouldn't say that this is like high on the list. Um, <laughs> but you know, if they'll sleep, it's, it's doable. Um, anyway, I'm going to get back to paddling, but, uh, yeah, this is canoeing next to the boundary waters. Uh, this kayak was like $43 or canoe was like $43. So it was super worth it. We decided even if it was just like an hour trip. So anyway. Fun times. Oh, Wanna say bye, Guthrie? <laughs> bye. No buys from Guthrie. All right. Okay, I'm turning back on the camera because Guthrie wants to say bye. Okay, Guthrie, you want to say bye? Bye. <laughs> Watch out. Guthrie, can I take your ukulele and pack it? No. Why not? Mine. Mine. What do you want to do with it? I want to jam. You want to jam?
Godfather love is making music with my friends. I just Let's can't wait to get on, on the road again. So much poop. So much poop. <laughs> and, then, and then the cousins. And then, and then the you really cat. think poop is funny, don't you? And then the remember last time I visited you and your dad? Yeah. And you were like, this is my favorite book. It's called Everybody Poops. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I really like poop. It's funny to poop. <laughs> you say they like pooping? Yeah, they like pooping because they poop in their pants.